gripping ground. I have so much respect for parents. Yeah, apparently that's what I heard, that the um, food accommodation is already sorted. So why on earth has you know, so much been asked for? Two, why wasn't any of it touched for the things they claim it's going towards? Why wait till it got to like 36 grand? Why? If you wanted to help your fam your friend bring her family over because she's missing her family, why didn't they withdraw some before? Why didn't they call withdraw a couple of thousand then just to buy the tickets and to pay for the accommodation for, for, for a couple of weeks over here? You know what I mean? Why? Why wait till it got to like 36,000 and then all of a sudden it's now 39 and then we draw 36,000. But apparently she's only taking a part of it. A part of the GoFundMe. She's taking a big chunk of that money. And I swear to God, it's not just to fly, buy, fly her friend's family over. It's not. It's not. And we're uh, looking into it. People are looking into it to see if that. These people who are out there searching, if they're allowed, if they can take donations, because we're not sure if they can. Right? So, anyway, this is one of the interviews by his father. And hands down, I'd go for this father, you know what I mean? He's boots on the ground. He's out there looking for his son. All right, so here you go. Emergency services continuing their focus on these mountains in Tenerife, their efforts to find Jace later. The 19-year-old from Lancashire went missing after attending a music festival on the island on his first holiday abroad. Jay's family visited the scene today. His dad, Warren, confronted with fears no parent ever wants to face. Nightmare. It's just been a, it's been a nightmare. Just hoping that somebody has helped him off this mountain. That's all. That's all I want. Is that somebody has helped him get off this mountain. So many of the questions around what happened begin here with this villa, where Jay came with two men. Hours later, he disappeared. Ophelia, who runs the cafe above the villa, was most likely the last person to see Jay. She told him what time the bus was coming. Before... Uh, apparently, this Ophelia is lying. What has she got to get gain from lying? Nothing. For he headed in the opposite direction into the National Park, where his phone was last located. This area is difficult terrain for even experienced hikers like Susanna. She walked part of the area that was combed by search teams yesterday. It's, it's very difficult. So I'm an athletic person um, and the way down was difficult on the knees. Um, the way up, you know, halfway through having had lunch, having had adequate water, having had a hiking pole to help us along um, was very difficult. Um, by the end, it was, you know, really a, a mind over matter. So this is the route through the mountains where they're looking for Jay. It's a really narrow path that's difficult for drivers and even more difficult. Yeah, I've reported it as well, Slob. It should have been stopped. It should have been a hold put on that. Because it wasn't put in the comment, in that description, what the money was going to be used for in the first place. It never was. So what are you donating to? What are you doing out into? They, they haven't told you what, you, they've done, what the money was going to be used for in the first place. And then it was going to be not touched. Right? Why? Because they needed to get that money built up to a certain level. But for anyone who would have been on foot. Beneath the beauty, Parts of the landscape are arid. On this volcanic island, temperatures can reach 30 degrees Celsius this time of year. Difficult conditions for any search operation. 
Lancashire police offered to help with the search, but it was turned down, with the civil guard insisting they have enough resources. Well, to be honest with you, Lancashire police, come on. They couldn't even find a flipping woman in a river. You know what I mean? But at the heart of this is a family who are here and hurting as they clutch onto their hopes for a miracle. I just want my body by and that's it. So I love... I feel sorry for the father, I really do. Yeah, yeah. So, hang on. Let's just put some of these comments up. Um, it said it's going towards Jane to help. Um, Hang on. Doesn't say that either, does he? Doesn't say anywhere in here that it's going towards Jay. He's got a title, gets Jay Slater home, with a picture and things, right? Then it says, hi everyone, my name is Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. I have come on holiday to Tenerife to attend the NRG festival. No, you was working, sweetheart, you was working. With my friend Jay and another friend. Oh, and by the way, that other friend who I said the other night wasn't him. I believe the other friend was another dealer. That's why she won't say his name. On the day of the festival, I left alone, earlier than everyone else. Oh, poor you. Poor you, so tired. Because I was tired from the weekend. I woke up to a phone call off Jay at 8.30am. That didn't happen. It's been proved, it's been shown that she had no phone call. And not only that, I'll, I'll carry on. Saying he was lost in the mountains, he wasn't aware of his surroundings, he ne desperately needed to drink, and his phone was on 1%. Well, I'm sorry, what she's down somewhere, right? And he's up in the mountains, half an hour, well, half an hour away or more, and he desperately needs to drink. What the hell is she supposed to do? Oh, just hold on, I'll be there in a tick, I'll bring you a drink. You know what I mean? Oh, God. Mm, well, he had met two people on Sunday night and left with them to go to their apartment. Why did his so-called friends who he was with pull him away and say, look, we're going home now and take him with them? He obviously was a bit worse for wear. Right? So why didn't they just collar him and pull him away? Come on, we're going home, you've got to get home, we've got to get that bag back. You know what I mean? He left that miles away from civilisation and in a very secluded location. He left at 8am and walked half an hour before frantically ringing me when his phone reached 1%. This was three days ago now and no one has seen or heard from him since. Is the weather conditions up there are terrible for someone in shorts and a t-shirt, both in the day and at night. He has no water for when it's warm throughout the day and has no coat, suitable clothing for when it's cold at night. It was one degree and extremely windy when I was out looking in the middle of the night. Why was you out there in the middle of nowhere, in rough terrain, in the middle of the night, Lucy? Talk sense. Talk fucking sense, sweetheart. What are you going to find? You're going to find feck all. Why wasn't you out there in the daytime? We are so worried and we just want him home. Please help if you can and share far and wide. Thank you for reading. It says nothing about there, in there, as to what... The um, it was for 
Now it's only in this one, the second update, that she mentions this. Well, first of all, she goes to withdraw part, part. Hmm. But why would they edit that bit out? Why would they edit that bit out? Because this is the one I've seen from the first time I've, I heard about it. And that was on that uh, YouTuber's channel. And I've not seen anything about how it was for Jay. If it wasn't there, why was it edited out? So now, because I know the mother did put one statement. I can't see if I, I can't get the other one. I think once you update it, it Takes the other one. Oh, see, older updates. Hold on. Right, this is the first update that Debbie the mother put out. Right. First, I would like to thank everyone for your support, kind messages, and good wishes. Difficult. That's right, she put in the second one. No, that's update two. Oh, it is. Here it is. Here's the, sec the first one. Hi everyone, this is Debbie J's mother. Thank you all for generosity and kindness during this difficult time. I wanted to confirm that this is the only GoFundMe fundraiser approved by our family. We have not yet withdrawn any funds and are currently covering the expenses, such as a trip to Tenerife and accommodation ourselves. The funds will remain on hold with GoFundMe. We, until we post a further update on this page. We are extremely worried and are going, doing everything we can to find Jay. Please continue to share our fundraiser far and wide. Your support means the world to us and we are grateful for any help you can give us. Right, that was the first one. Then this is the second one. We are currently working with GoFundMe to withdraw part of the funds which have been safely held. And all that. But this is what got me. This is what got me. This bit. Since our stay in Tenerife needs to be extended, we will also use the funds to cover accommodation and food expenses. I'm surrounded by wonderful people who are by my side, but far from their loved ones. So we'll be also be using part of these funds to fly them to Tenerife so we can support each other during these dark times. Okay, who wants to go abroad? Who wants to book a flight to some foreign country? I'll go missing, right? But really, I'm hiding under a bed or something, but I'll go missing. And then you lot can put out a GoFundMe, and we'll go halves. We'll go halves on the GoFundMe. Right? Or I'll go and hide in another little village somewhere miles the other side of the the other side of Tenerife, sunbathing on the beach. They won't recognise me. Right? I'd be getting a nice tang. The go from me would be going up lovely. You'll all be searching the other side of Tenerife. So I think we could do. I think we could do that. So who's up for that? I think we could get about £40,000 raised. That's £20,000 each if someone wants to do it. Oh, and then we can pay for our family to come over as well. I could pay for my son and her, his wife and their two kids and my daughter and her partner and their son. Oh, and his mum and his dad. Pay for everyone to come over. You know what I mean? To help look for me, but really we're not, we're sitting on a beach. 
Come on. He's not sitting on a beach. His cartel have not got him. Because cartel, the cartel will not give them this long. It's 11 days. Will not give them 11 days to get the money together. Will not. They'll probably give them about three, four days. And as you know, she raised it within three days. She raised 30 in three days. So I don't think the cartel have got him. So let's have a look. What else have I got on here? Anything on my ex account? Oh yes. Yes. Go okay, back to my ex account. It's another TikTok. Hope you like TikToks. Because TikTok is going crazy over this. Going crazy. Hold on, share this tab. Right. Oh, God. Here we go again. With the problems getting this up to go. Come on. Right. It's only a minute long. Right. Oh, go. I can't play the music. So you'll just have to read what it says, okay? I'll get flagged on YouTube. I would have given oh. anything. Right. Right, I'm going to, oh God, let's see if I can get this up a little bit. Right, between 3am and 6am, BST, which is whatever time, summertime, Jay goes back to an Airbnb with two men after they leave Plaza, Plaza de Gala, America, in a car. Right, 7.30am, James Jay shares a photo on his Snapchat account which shows him standing at the doorway of a house with the location Prague Rural Detainer. But that's wrong because that Prague Rural Detainer is over the other side of the mountains. It wasn't in Prague Rural Detainer, they was in Moscow. Right, between 8.30 and 9 a.m., Jay calls Lucy. That didn't happen. He says he's lost in the mountains with 1% battery with no water. 1% battery, you'd be lucky to get a signal. And has missed a bus back south and was attempting to walk. It will take 11 hours. I'm sorry, but if he's walking, if he could just start walking down that hill, he could have hiked, hitchhiked a lift down that hill. Because they said it's quite popular that route is for hikers and tourists because of the views. And you get a lot of hikers go up there because they, they know what they're doing. Right? And will take 11 hours. The call cuts out and the phone's last location is a path in the rugged rural Now, how would they know the phone's last location is a path in the rugged rural Detengo National Park? How? How would you know? Because it doesn't... When... <clears throat> when a phone is pinged, it does not say, Oh, there it is on that path. It's that path. Right there, see? There. It doesn't do that. It shows the general area. It just shows the general area. 
of Grand Coupe. Right? Grainy CCTV released on June 24 shows a possible sighting of Jay at Santiago at around 6 pm, nearly 10 hours after his mobile phone last pinged in the rural Declano Park at around 8.50 am. The CCTV is taken close to a church, San Fernando Ray, where Jay's mother told Mail Online a man has come forward to say he saw someone matching her son's description sitting on a bench with two men. Well, I'm sorry, but, right, look, look, back annoying, I can't find it, but just seeing apparently all his mates have flown back here, old phones, phones, which he likely has, can be still pinged on by my phone, but yeah, but only a short while, yeah, I found that out last night, right, now, this, this lag. Why? I don't, it's just frustrating because there's so much. Right, what was I watching? What was I reading? What was I reading? Can't remember now what I was reading. Oh, okay. Right. Now, see that picture of Jay? Right? There's a lot of lads like that. With that style of haircut. You know what I mean? Look, that style of clothing, t-shirts and shorts. It could be anyone. Anyone. You're telling me he's the only lad out there with that style of haircut, those style of clothes? No. No, 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 no. Not happening. I'm telling you now, when, when we lost our grandson for a matter of 10 minutes, 10 minutes of that, my heart was pounding. Shortly after we found him, another call went out for another little girl. Right? His name was Olivia. She got dark hair, wearing a pink coat. So by now I've got older my grandson's old hand and I'm not letting that hand go. But me and my son decided while his wife stayed with their grand with their little girl, decided just to have a little nosy round see if we could find anything. My grandson said How are we supposed to find her? And what do you mean? It's like they were all wearing pink coats. And there was. And guess what? My daughter, granddaughter's name is Olivia. And guess what? She was wearing a pink coat. So you're telling me, in all those people that went to this place, he's the only lad who looked like that. Go on all these TikToks. Right? Um, go on, try and find one. Oh, is this one? Let's have a look. I'll turn the five seconds on that one. I don't want that one. That's not going to show us nothing. Oh, God. When was this? I know it was a day ago. I'm trying to find footage of, I know it's out there, of Jay Slater with his friends and they literally all look the same.
Oh, come on. Yeah. This was two days ago. Right? Uh, let me share. Take that off. Let me share this. Right. It just all I'm asking is you look at the legs, the hairstyles. Right. Just look at this hairstyle because. Because you're telling me he's the only lad with a hairstyle like that. No. There's one there with a hairstyle like that. There's another one. You know what I mean? So... He looks a bit worried, actually. He looks a bit worried. And there's Lucy then. That was Lu- Hold on. Hold on. Lucy then. There. That was Lucy. That was Lucy. That is Lucy there. Because there's a photo. Uh, another picture of Lou seeing him and that she's talking to him. Right? I thought she'd left early. See, this is footage of Jade leaving the NRG festival. She said she'd left early. But that is her. I swear to God, I wish I could find that. Picture yam. Oh God, where is it? Oh, hold on. I think I know where it is. Hold on. Oh, Instagram, Instagram, not Facebook, Instagram, Instagram. Right. Um. Is this see? Is this one I'm after? Oh yeah, sorry, yeah. That picture, that one I was looking for was on Instagram. Look. Right, this there is Lucy. Right, he'll go back. There she is. She said she left early. She said she left early. She was still there as he was leaving. She was still there as he was leaving. 
Let's go back to that again. Right? No, that isn't you. Remember that picture? Keep that picture in mind. Keep that picture in mind, Deb. That picture there, that shot, is the same as that one. Lying little toe rag up with Lucy, but finding your lies out. Fucking left early. BS. I'll probably get flagged so much for this video today because of what I'm saying. Which is a lying little. Oh. I really hate people like that. So there she is in a video. Right? And that, hang on, let's just go back. And there she is again. Hang on, let's share this tab. She said she left early. I'm putting a comment. I'm going to say, I thought. Huh? Lucy had left early. But that is definitely Lucy, because if you look at that picture there, and then look at this one, oh God, stop messing about. And look at this one, it's the same outfit, everything. That is her. You know what I mean? And yet she left early. He left before she had. Because that was him leaving. That was him leaving 